All right, this is my LMG build that I have built up due to the fact that it already has the Petrov gloves for the LMG. You don't need to use Petrov in another area. So next best in slot is the Walker and Harris, giving you that extra weapon damage. Um, don't really use this LMG builds a lot, but I thought I'd just pull it up here just for people that like to use them. Um, and same best in slot, Contractors, Fox Prez, Coyote Mask, and then it's going to be your crit chance on your Suska is essential, and then obviously your crit damage. You can run it with a Walker and Harris second piece, I guess. However, I haven't tested it, so I don't know the damage drop off between the two, actually. So I can't even tell you which one hits harder. I'm assuming that per crit, this build hits harder. And then normal damage, the damage to armor would hit harder. Obviously, because it's a non crit damage, I'm assuming that's how the damage will play out. Stats wise, you're looking at 55 crit chance with 142 crit damage, and then obviously, with the damage to armor that you get from the no, it's damage to tags out cover. So, sorry, the damage to tags out cover will be 20%, and then the damage to armor will be 8%. It's flipped from shotguns again. Specialization and skills depend on you. Again, I go with the gunner. And uh, for the post, just so I can confuse them and stack them up long enough with the LMG. You can run the glass cannon plus the lens. That would just use the glass cannon version of the Providence Perfect uh, glass cannon. Since you're already using the LMG gloves, as I said. So you wouldn't need to use the glass cannon assault rifle version build. You just use the... Not the Providence version. If he was going to run the Glass Cannon Pestilence build, however, I stopped running that. The viability of using it in a fight, it the LMG is just too slow to stack, and then players just don't stand there still a long enough. Unless it's an armor build with a shield or something, you rarely get a lot of stacks because the player dies super quick with the damage output that the LMG hits or and then the stacks on top of it with the glass cannons you don't stack them up enough to actually spread killable spread to the other enemies so it's like it doesn't work out and then obviously being glass cannon you're just stuck in the back at a long distance and using the pestilence at 600 rpms is not great to be in that situation so now I run it with Unbreakable and Vigilance and it's I use it a bit more than I used to but again I'm, I'm not a fan of LNGs but this is my LNG build. <laughs>